Isn't it amazing? Like, I'm not having to go at anyone here, believe me. But at the end of each sermon, you always hear, now, come to Jesus And everyone turns their Bibles, zips them up, throws them up, finished, uh, well, we're at the end now. It's the beginning. Oh, I've already done that. It's like reading a scripture, and when a scripture's read out, it's familiar to you, and you go, yep, I know that one. But we haven't had that time to meditate. We're talking about with Pastor Anthony this morning. Haven't had time to meditate on the things that we get familiar with. See, God might be speaking to you this morning. You may have been Christian for many years and God's saying to you, you know what, you're not right with me. Your life needs to be put on track. Your life needs to be totally resold again at this point. You see, and if you just think, oh, this is the time we're closing, you may have missed it. I'm going to ask the ushers to come up. We're going to hand out communion. But it begins with a heart decision, which is, it's followed by a head decision. And this morning, we need to come and remember what Jesus Christ did at the cross. If you're not baptised, the Bible says, and Jesus, one of his commandments was to be baptised. You need to be baptised. But he asked us to do this. And even if he didn't ask it, I'd like to do it because I enjoy to think about him. This reminds me, as that reminds me, wherever the cross has gone, reminds me of him. It's not an idol. And so tonight, today, what we're doing is we're just saying to God, we give back everything to you. We take this afresh. It's just a little bit of time out just to say, Lord, fresh. Give now money to God. Thank you for your goodness in my life. Touch many people, Lord. Do you know what? If we can look around this place and think, the money that we spent on this building could go to so many people out there we could feed. But do you know what? People who say that have a small mind in the way that, where are we all going to be? If this church grows to 500, 1,000 or whatever it is, where are we going to sit? Where are we going to be able to join together and then join our resources together to touch more? See what I'm saying? I feel that as well. Wouldn't it be wonderful to have something debt free? So then you can pour that into else. And it's coming one day. Just stand together. I'm going to pray right now at the beginning for the emblems and I want you to just come, come back. You might want to share, take an emblem, give it to someone else, just be in partnership with them, pray for them, whatever you like. Father, thank you for your message this morning, Lord, that the greatness of you, the goodness of you, compassionate, merciful, forgiving, loving, healing, delivering, all those wonderful things, Lord. And we come as your children right now. And we come and do this in remembrance of you because that's what we want. We want to do it, Lord. And I pray a blessing upon each person here, Lord, as they come. We pray the finance that's given, Lord, will continue to touch, touch hundreds and thousands of people as it does each month outside this church. And we give you glory. And we give it all to you. Amen.